Okay, I'm sitting here with uh, Question Authority. They just played their set at the Knitting Factory at the Harvest Fest 2011. I just want to come out and say uh, uh, you guys are great and uh, enjoyed the show. Do you guys have anything to say to your fans? Uh, thanks to everybody who came down to watch us, and thanks to Jason for booking us on this bill. Uh, we understand what it's like to throw a big festival like this, booking multiple bands. We definitely understand his position. We appreciate getting put on the bill, and, and it was a fun. It was a fun gig to play. It really, it's been fun. It's been a good time. Yeah, yeah, man. Fun, fun gig, and um, just looking forward to the next one. Yeah, I appreciate all the help we got backstage. Those guys are awesome. The, 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 the staff here at the uh, Knitting Factory. It's just awesome. They're great. They help us out, and they make the, the transition smooth. Well, um, uh, you guys have any uh, plans to put any music out on the web, or do you have some music out there now? We got, we're working on a new, new CD. We've still uh, got a couple more songs to go until we have a full album's worth, but we'll be putting a new album out, hopefully, I don't know, within the next year or so, um, get it out there. We've got a lot of new material. Even our set tonight, uh, most of it was new. Hadn't been played live uh, much before, so... Uh, that's kind of the direction we're heading is get some new material and get it into print and uh, put it out there for people to check it out. For some of you guys who don't know, uh, Question Authority has been around forever. I used to go watch you guys in your mom, your parents' garage uh, back in the mid-90s. Uh, I don't remember when you guys started and all, uh, but uh, if you could just uh, you know kind of tell us a little bit about your beginnings. About, uh, about 1991, it was, it was actually Mike. I was one of the original members of the band. All different members at that point. Um, and then in about 92, we started, we started coming together. And from there, man, it's been, it's been rocking. It's been cool. We've got about a, yeah, we got about a 20-year a history behind us. And, you know, JK has been in here for the last 10. And it's, it's, it's awesome. We, honestly, we just love playing. We love the music. We love the local music scene. We love everything about it, you know. Well, I know you guys uh, know Jason and uh, knew that the Harvest West was coming and so on, but uh, when did you guys find out that uh, you were playing? Uh, well, like, like Wednesday? Wednesday? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we, we asked them to consider us. They were, they were doing a drawing for the last slot, and we asked them to put us into consideration. And we were fortunate enough to get drawn out of the hat, and we, we, are, we feel very privileged to be able to play this show. I think this is going to be a good thing. What they've got going on is the Harvest Fest. I, I do think it's going to be a good thing. Hopefully we're at the first inaugural one, and hopefully we'll be at the tenth one down the road. Awesome. Yeah, you guys uh, oh, definitely a force here uh, in, in the, the Valley as a local band, and it's nice to see you come out and support everything. You guys made a, had a chance to go out to uh, uh, the one out in the woods, right? What was that called? The uh, Yeah, Rock the Mountain. You guys? Yeah. Yeah, that's uh, been kind of a little project of ours for, what, 14 years now. And honestly, it's really cool to get put on a bill like this where somebody else is out doing the work and booking all the bands. We've kind of, we've done that gig, you know, and we've, we've booked a lot of bands doing Rock the Mountain for the past several years. And we understand the, uh, the trials and tribulations you go through when you're dealing with this many bands. But that's why our kudos go out to Jason, all the guys behind Harvest Fest. This is, this is a good thing, and I, I really want to see it succeed. I really do. I, I just want to see it take off, and I, we give him our support. We pledge him our, our whole support to say, let's make this, this be the next biggest thing, you know? Well, I'm not sure when uh, um, Rock the Mountain started, but I heard you guys were kind of the, there the first time and so on. And, and uh, do you feel like this is going to kind of evolve into something that's going to end up having a big following like, like Rock the Mountain does? Yeah, I hope it does. I really do. Um, I think I think they got a great thing going, and uh, it'll just get bigger and better every year. You know, you learn things in the in the first few years that make it better and better by by year ten. So, yeah, I'm adding total support and total props to Harvest Fest. Right, I will. Uh, the last thing I just want to ask you guys is, uh, uh, if, if you have anything to tell your fans, and I know you guys thanked them already, but uh, have any future plans to let your fans know about that uh, you might have in the works or anything? You know, we're working on, on kind of revamping a website, getting that back up going again. And uh, we got a show next weekend on 23rd down at the Linen Building. So, uh, obviously, we love the crowds, man. Come out and see us. We're trying to stay active in the local scene. We love the local music scene. You know, it's, it's grown a lot over the last, well, over the last 20 years since we've been in it. It's grown a lot. It's changed a lot from 91 to where we're at right now. And we love it. We support it. We want to 
make sure uh, everybody else comes out and supports it too. When we get all these people together, just jamming together and having a good time, you know, that's what it's all about. That's why we all play. We love to play. That's that's right. That's what it's all about. Having a good time. Thanks everyone.